All right, let's jump into the show, shall we? Yeah. Um, accuser number 24 is coming today. Do we know, have the papers been filed yet? Jason, do you know? Or is it it's expected to be filed today? I, I think we're just, they're just ex waiting for the stamp at the Yeah, I, I meant to check just before we went on. As of about 9 o'clock this morning, it had not been filed. Yeah. But I, th they're a, a little bit behind us in Houston. So the 24th accuser is a coming today. We know the 23rd happened last week. Right. Yeah. There was some interesting developments on Friday. And by interesting, I mean, what the hell is Rusty Harden thinking? <laughs> um, the Russian wow. mob law lawyer. So, so Rusty Harden went on a radio station in Houston on Friday and actually opened a can that he didn't need to open. And I'm not sure anybody, legal community or sports community, can figure out why exactly he said what he said. If you haven't heard it, listen carefully and ask yourself, is this the guy you want representing you? Here it is. Stevie? I don't know how many men are out there now that have had a massage that perhaps Occasionally, there was a happy ending. All right? Maybe there's nobody in your listening audience that that ever happened to. I do want to point out, if it has happened, it's not a crime. Okay? Unless you are paying somebody extra or so to give you some type of sexual activity, it's not a crime. And All right. so at the end of the day, uh, that's another thing that would affect conduct. Doing something or saying something or being a way that makes you uncomfortable is not a crime. And so we've had two grand juries find that, and nobody seems to want to listen. By the way, Rusty Harden separated at birth with my great aunt Flory. They look like twins. <laughs> Nobody besides me knows what I mean, she's dead now, but I'm telling you, she, she, that could be my great aunt right there. Did she have any law experience? She had no Because I'm beginning no. to question she Rusty's for, credentials. Uh, a Bank Street College, which doesn't make sense that that's a Jason, college. I want you to start on this because. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I started. Like, you know what, Deshaun, Deshaun, oddly, enough, oddly enough, that was exactly Deshaun Watson's reaction. <laughs> and the Browns. What and in Kevin the Stavansky world is he doing? Jimmy. I have no, I have no. You know what I was most upset about? I had Rusty on the radio week before, and I asked him that exact question. He didn't give me that answer. No, he said. I would have loved him to give yeah, me that answer. He said pretty answer. much nothing when you asked Oh, it. I said, Rusty, I've had a lot of massages in my life. None of them ended in sex. How does this happen? He didn't tell me. He didn't use happy endings on me. Like, I would have loved if he just said happy ending. When you get a happy ending in a massage, it's because you went to a hooker. <laughs> yeah, it's not a massage. <laughs> it's, 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 it's a prostitute you that's a dressed up as a massage therapist. I, I, I just, I, I was <laughs> gobsmacked when, I, man, when, I, when, I, when I saw that. Because someone at The Athletic actually said it to me first. I was like, what is he thinking? Because, okay, I thought it was an onion headline. It, that, it, right? Like, most of this case looks like an onion onion headline but I mean legally okay fine he's right but in the context of what we're talking about Rusty why would you why would well, you get, why? Yeah, it's, it's apropos why? of nothing no one has ever no one has accused you, him you, of paying you, for you, sex you, you, here you got a couple things going on here that was the craziest comment ever right so Rusty Hart has done his job in, in the criminal world this has been removed right you may need for now a, you may you for now yeah you may need another representation for the civil case it's different right the case here, Rusty Hart should say nothing, right? Nothing more to say. I don't know why they feel like they have to respond to every Tom, Dick, and Harry. Well, because now it's be, they're playing ping pong in the, with well, the media, well, right? I mean, yeah. Jason, you know that because so, you had both Busby and Harden but on you gotta go to, in successive you gotta days. Go. Right. Busby's game is to chase the dollars. That's all he's doing, chasing the money. Yes. I'm going to bring more pressure on you, more pressure on you, and you're going to settle me because these, these clients are not going to be able to pay me. I'm going to need I'm gonna need Deshaun Watson to pay me, yeah. right? So that's what this game is. And so to the point, if you think – that you're going to talk your way out of this, right? You just open yourself up for more ammo coming at your way, right? That was the dumbest well, comment ever. I'm if, glad if you I'm said Deshaun that. I'm Watson, glad you... guys, I'm not settling no matter what. I know we've been through this. I know it's probably best oh, for yes, all of us. Oh, yes, you about. are. I wouldn't. Why? If, if, because if I'm not guilty of anything, I will not admit guilt of anything. That's In the real world, that's yes. perfectly well and good. Yes. I but I know where Jason's happen. going. Yeah. Where Jason's going is like, okay, what the hell is coming next? I'm taking fire. I'm taking friendly fire from my own attorney. I'm shot by my own attorney. Yeah, I mean, yeah. so obviously the 23rd and the 24th, not a good look. Right. G. Bush, who's been not an apologist for D. Watson, but he's had an answer for everything, as yeah. a lot of folks have. When the 23rd came out, he goes, all right, this is, this is starting to not look so good. And that's G. Bush. So yeah. I, th I think you're taking 23rd, 24th. Your lawyer puts his foot in it. Yeah. And now... He, okay, so I want to get to his cleanup comment, but before we read that quote, can we have, Steve and, and Mikey, can we have 
the Busby response. So this is what Harden has done now in terms of how this case might play out. Busby says, this may have single-handedly lost his client the case because I'm absolutely Not going true. to use that comment because I think it speaks volumes to how he his team and his client think about the massage well, industry. That's not true, right? Uh, here, he, I he, agree he, with I, you. He, he's playing the game, yes, right? The right. Game, sure, he's saying what the, he the has game, to the say. Game is, not, the, ga the game is being played, right? So the response is he just opened himself to, up to the attack. Now, to Jason's point, I will tell you this. Why well, somebody get in the room? Because this thing is not going anywhere, right? And the Browns here, when they paid the $230 million, they may not have said it, but I gave you enough firepower to walk yourself out of it. Amen. Right? Yeah, Here's that's $45 million what, yep, that's what it is. signing yep. bonus. Right? That's yeah. what Go it is. get rid because of Because to your point, he's not going to win this like that, right? This is not going away. Busby's not going away. He has to get paid, right? Sure. And he's not getting paid for them clients. I he's understand. Only <laughs> well, all you're saying is makes sense. All I know is if I were innocent, of, as he claims to be, I would never. And I'm with you. Him. I'm with you. I would you. never settle. However, I do think you're right. I think ultimately they will settle. There's a lot of pressure here. And Rusty Harden, where Rusty Harden, think about this, guys. You know, we keep thinking of this suspension in terms of what he might have done or not done criminally. Right. But the bottom line is the league can suspend him yes. for conduct detrimental to yeah, the league, right, inappropriate yeah. things. And that doesn't well, mean illegal. Right. No, no. So if Rusty Harden is saying, hey, we all get yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> then, then basically he's saying, fair or not, that my client got a bunch of happy endings. The league don't want to hear about that. But he didn't pay for them. <laughs> Whether he paid for them or not, the league doesn't <laughs> want to hear about that, and that could affect his suspension. Well, yeah. let's – let's um, the Harden cleanup. So, yeah. after – I can By only way, imagine – I'm happy telling you, Deshaun – By the way, I think, the happy I think Busby's <laughs> quote is correct, except for the fact that it won't definitely lose him the case. No, no I, right? I think that's no, hyperbole, that's but that's what these guys – But, but yeah. he's right that the quote shows a level of disrespect from at least Harden, not necessarily Watson, but at least Harden, and for massage therapists. To, to Brad's point and to your point, I don't yeah. think that that's going to swing whether this no. case is won or lost. No, I, I, but I will yeah. say, if you're putting things in either Deshaun's camp or in Busby's camp, this certainly is ammo for Busby Without if it goes to trial. Right. Yeah. I'm going to ask him. you guys, remind me to ask you guys the, the payoff question here after we read this, because Harden... I'm sure got a phone call from the Browns <laughs> and from Deshaun Watson, yeah, yeah. and it, it went something like this: "What the hell? What the? Day? And it wasn't hell. <laughs> did I just hear?" So then he goes into spin mode and says, "Deshaun did not pay anyone for sex. I was using the term hypothetically and not describing Deshaun's case. I have reiterated to other it's others it's not okay to do anything that a woman does not agree to. Yeah, Even though in his soundbite he said." Making someone uncomfortable is not against the law. Clean up on aisle 10. Yeah, right? and this 11, is and 12. Is, this fire this is what this that is. would be the move right now. Well, you know, I, I thought maybe that he might do that, but yeah. I think what he's doing internally, so he doesn't want that, that headline. Right. Yeah. I think what he's probably doing is saying, Rusty, you're a figurehead. Shut your damn mouth. Yeah. And perhaps someone else on the team, maybe the woman who spoke to HBO Sports, who I thought was incredibly buttoned up. Yeah. Maybe she becomes the lead dog here. But I don't think you want Rusty Harden arguing this case in front of a jury. Well, here's what's kind of odd about how they've attacked this whole thing is, is they were silent for so long. I right. know. You never heard anything from Rusty or his defense team. And they were just, they were taking fire and they were taking hits. And Busby would talk to anyone who would listen. And, and Rusty was not counterpunching at all. And I, I texted him when Deshaun first came to Cleveland. I reached out to, to Rusty, never got a response from him. And then all of a sudden like that, it turned and they started firing now. And now yeah. they're trying to answer. It, it was the HBO special, right? That yeah. had a lot to do that with that. HBO special brought a lot of heat here. They weren't expecting this. I think, I, they so they, it was they Rusty on, saying, they, oh, we're going to play this in the they media. They were on Let's the go. front side of it, right? And so it's different heat than in the courtroom case, in, the criminal case in Houston. Sure. But now you have to sit out here and figure out Okay, what, how am I responding? When am I responding? Because the more he says, he's just giving more ammo, even if it does mean, mean nothing, right? That little bit of sound bite you just got out of him and said, see, I told you, they know something is going on here. Right. I think Rusty was very honest when, because we, we talked about this, and he said, like, listen, we were never going to win the PR battle. Like, it was just too much. That could not be my focus at the moment. We had to focus on the criminal component of this. Once that, once the no bill came back and we knew there was not going to be any criminal charges, then we could move on to the NFL and then we could move on to the public perception of it. And so I, cause I've told a couple people, they need to talk. Like if you don't talk, this is my big thing. I say it all the time. If you don't talk, it's we talk for Rusty you. Rusty Hart don't want comes that. off as a rich entitled D bag, but that's what he comes but, off as. 
and it's making his client look bad by extension. I mean, hearing Rusty Friday, I thought, okay, you know what? Maybe you shouldn't be talking. Yeah, that was shouldn't. the that was the first time, and I don't want to bring age into this, but this was the first time where old. I looked at Rusty and yeah. thought, boy, he's 80 years old. Mm-hmm. He's at the end of his career. Yeah, he's lost his fastball. Maybe he shouldn't be out. And because yeah. I thought he handled himself well when he was on 92 3, because I pressed him on a couple different things. And yeah. I thought he handled himself really well. But then hearing that on Friday, I was like, yeah. Oh, wow. But, but okay. Jason saw reactionary, right? He, I don't, they're feeling this undue pressure, right? Because the, pu- the public swell is, is, is building out here on them, right? And so they feel like they have to respond, boo, in every every yeah. shape, form, or fashion. And every time you respond, they're going to pick that apart. Well, if that was Busby's yeah. strategy, it worked. Uh, Let's well, just see, get course. Rusty to talk. Jay, but they're picking off pieces and parts, right? If you read if you read Busby's statement, it was nonsensical, right? But he's like, oh, they lost the case on this. I yeah, didn't but lose, that's didn't you lose know anything. we get caught up sometimes too. Most people in America don't care about this story. In Cleveland, they care, sure. There's a new story every day. I mean, it's like something else new. You well, got- if you if you take into account, Bull, that he is a top five quarterback in the NFL, I I, I think that people are watching this with interest. Yeah. I, I don't think they're scouring the internet for the latest every right. day. We are. Right. But I don't think I, I don't think nationally that's going on. But I think that there, a lot of eyeballs are on this case in particular. I think on the NFL yeah. to see what they do. Last week we floated the the idea that Charles Robinson has had said, and he's a Yahoo reporter who seems to be plugged into this story Definitely, somehow. Yeah. He made the, the the point on his podcast, I believe, late last week that, you know, he believes it could be a year, and he believes the Browns are preparing for it to be a year. That kind of I raised my eyebrows uh, when I heard that. So a couple things on that, and I'll try to move quick. Number one. I don't think it's a year because if it's a year, then they would have just put him on the commissioner's exempt list. You would think. And and Roger Goodell has already said that's off the table. So to me, that's less than a year. If the Browns are now preparing for a year, that's a completely different song than what they've been singing up until this yeah. point. And I don't know what drastically has changed. 23 and 24 does not make this a year. No. Like, no. It's, it's, no. I don't want this to sound callous. 22 is the same as 24 is the same as 34. Right. As long as the allegations are similar. Now, if a woman comes out and says... He raped me. Everything stops. Game, yeah. Right. Yeah, 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 now yeah. the criminal component comes back in and everything stops and everything changes. I don't, as long as the allegations stay similar, I don't think 23 and 24 so, really make a yeah, difference. Why is the league waiting? Why is the league waiting right now? Well, like, because, don't they we, want it off the plate? No, because it's, 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 it's a very sensitive issue. Let me just tell you, you know how sensitive it is. And I'll tell you this, and, I, and I'm a proponent. I told you, I'm clear to tell you. I got four daughters. I'm concerned, right? It's going to play as it plays, only as it plays along the entire way. We have to see this in the entirety. Right. Now, what, what, what the problem is, and I know what Goodell's the problem is, right? Because if they come out with something, um, uh, suspension that is out, out of line, what is perceived out of line out yeah. here, there's a section of this, of this country that's going to light into them. Sure. Right? Waiting on it. Right? This might be on, the on, biggest on, rock and hard on, place on the Goodell's east side ever of been in. Waiting on it. Right? Okay. Because you have a... Uh, uh, a gentleman that has just got cl- gotten out of the criminal case in Houston, right? Won't face criminal charges. Right, that has tied the NFL's hands to a degree, right? Sure. Because this should have been put to bed. Although, right? although there's precedent set. Yeah, there's but been the no problem, criminal charges problem, in other cases. If it looks like it's out of line and out of skew, yeah. Boy, they're going to so the, how do you think, get, they're gonna get the kitchen sink coming at So them. how do you think the Trevor Bauer thing plays into it? Well, I don't think it plays into it for, from, from Watson's standpoint because – I think baseball is on its own own game over there, right? You don't they're, think they're doing their they're... own thing, right? No. I think they try. I think the 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 impact on the NFL may be we got to do something, right? But it, it, but there's it, nobody Jason. waiting in LA for portion of the country not waiting in LA to see what happened. But about. Jason, let me ask you your own question. What do you think happened the, in the, the the day after? The uh, Manfred came out with two years. Two years. It's really three. Four. It is three because he lost year. last year yeah. after June or July, right. or whatever. What do you think the the conversations were in on Park Avenue in the NFL offices when that news came out? Because I was shocked by that, and I said immediately, "This puts the NFL in a real yeah. spot." The yeah, box. I don't know if the NFL cares what goes on in baseball because I had the same initial reaction of, "Oh boy, if Trevor got two years with yeah. no criminal indictment, what does this mean for Deshaun?" And and the NFL, you know, it, when when the whole Vax card came out, the N- N- NHL player forged a vax card yep. and, and got a significantly harsher suspension what the NFL gave Antonio Brown. So I don't know that necessarily they look at baseball. The NFL feels like they are they're above, they're above everyone, else. everyone else to begin. And with. I yeah. believe baseball was doing the Dodgers a favor. I don't think they want Trevor Bauer on the team and I don't think they want to pay. Him. And, and I think that factors in and that's not a case. In and I don't want to put everything on a scale because bad is bad. But right. what some of the things that the allegations against Bauer are a lot 
are are really violent compared to what is yeah. facing Deshaun. And, he's and I'm not in his sport. And I'm not trying to dismiss or or you know downplay what. The yeah. allegations yeah. against there Deshaun. There is different severities here. But there here. is different and, yeah. severities here. Okay, right. um, I, we're going to move on to our next topic. Before I do, one quick question. We'll blast around the panel. Yeah. The percentage of chance that you think this court or uh, this this case ever ends up in a courtroom? 10%. Five. One of them could. I think one of them could. But I think ultimately the NFL is going to pressure Deshaun to settle this now. Right now, settle all these they cases. They want this done with. I think the NFL is going to tell them, listen, clean this up and get rid of this, and it will be X number of games. If you don't, if you take this to trial and embarrass us, the gloves come off. Well, that's, 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 uh, you talk about an indirect message. They're not going to deliver a message like that for him to settle. But, they, but be, they, you know as well as I can do, they can tell him that. It's, yeah, it's they can without get that telling word. It's going to be indirect, right? They can, they can let his agent know yeah, because that if this goes to court and you lose, back. Right. I got it you. is an entirely different right. yeah. ball game. So I, I think one of them could go to trial, but not all 24. There's no way. I'm, I'm going to go with 1% chance that any of them see yeah. a courtroom. We'll see.